Konnichiwa what's up Nunis, my name is Wawa and today we're cooking delicious beef creamy mushroom which is ideal for dinner or lunch. Now let's move on. Welcome to my kitchen. Today we're going to make a mouthwater and beef creamy mushroom sauce. Before we start, let's have a look at the ingredients. For, so first, I made some rice so that I can balance my beef mushroom. And for the recipe, we need burger patties, garlic onions, more seasoning, salt, pepper, canned mushroom, all-purpose cream, and evaporated milk. For now, I don't have garlic and onion because I'm in my condominium. And you can substitute some of these ingredients according to taste and preference. You can find a complete list of ingredients in the description box below. Now that we all have the ingredients, let's start with the prepping. First, chop the garlic and onion into small pieces together with the mushroom. But since I don't have onion and garlic, I'm just this is just me and my mushroom. And then we season the burger patties with salt and pepper. Since I will be staying for my condor for just three days, I divided my patty into three sections. After that, we're gonna roll the patties into big balls or small balls or <laughs> any balls, you know, size doesn't matter. Just season it properly. Like I said, size doesn't matter, so just season them properly. Personally, I like my beef salty and with a lot of pepper, like a lot, like more, like more, more, like a lot, like hachu. In terms of cooking, first we heat the pan on the medium heat and add some oil. Once the oil is hot, cook the burger patties for about 3 to 4 minutes each side until fully cooked. I like my patty smashed so that it can cook evenly and add some more seasonings. Remove the patties from the pan and set aside once done. Mini ASMR time. In the same pan, add the chopped garlic and onion and saute them for 2-3 to three minutes. Imagine that I did that because I don't have onions and garlic. Let them get translucent and aromatic. Next is add the canned mushroom and saute them for 2-3 to three minutes and add some seasoning. Finally, add the all-purpose cream and evaporated milk to the pan and mix it well to the mushroom and onion mixture. Let this simmer for 2-3 to three minutes until the sauce is thickened. Don't forget to season it and add some more cubes if you want. I used um, Bear Brand sterilized milk because I don't have evaporated milk but it doesn't affect the taste that much. Trust me, I'm a college broke student and this works pretty damn good. Look at that squirting. So I got the desired thickness of my sauce which is the spoon test. That's my desired and now let's get ready plating. Now for the plating, I prefer them to put in a different container since I will be this is my meal prep and this will be my meal for college. So I prefer them to put a rice and then a burger patty and then a lot of sauce on top. This balance the saltiness of the sauce and the beef. And as a Filipino, I cannot live without the rice and then this generous amount of that sauce helped me to get through that patty and look at this imagine me putting something green on top i'm in manila so i can't really find anything as for the taste test thoughts the beef creamy mushroom sauce has a rich creamy texture with a perfect balance of flavor the nor seasoning adds a great taste to it to be honest and the mushroom adds a little bit of texture which is i like Overall, it's delicious, satisfying, and you can enjoy it with your family and friends or just in your college. So this concludes our video. I hope that you enjoy it. Please like and share and subscribe to my channel for more exciting recipes. And follow my social media. Stay updated with my recipes. Bye. Have a great day. Thank you so much.